Asraha and Nirgaha and Prutaha. So Kala Beta, Asraha, Nirgaha, Prutaha. Three are there. Okay. And uh, Ucharana Veda. Ucharana Veda. That is with the Nasika nasal without nasal. So na Anunasika. Anunasika and Ananunasika. Not Nasika. Ananunasika. Non nasal. Nasalized and non nasalized. So two. Right? Then Stana Veda. That is uh, Vedic chanting we do. It's called the intonation. Swara Veda. Swara Veda 3. Udartha, Udarthaha, Anudarthaha, and Swarita. Swara Veda, Swara Veda, Udarthaha, Anudarthaha, Swarita. Okay? 3. This is 3. And uh, Kala Veda 3, Rasvatirka Buddha and uh, Sthana Veda, that is 2. So 2, 3, 3. These are the, these are the uh, general classification. Now, let us take the, the verbal R, for example. The verbal R. So, the verbal R can be Ah, when you say it is Ananu Nasika, non nasalized, right? Ananu Nasika. So, verbal A uh, is Ananu Nasika. Or it could be Ananu Nasika, nasalized verbal, like in the Dhatu Anal we have seen, right? Dhatu Pata, the Pratya, nasalized, Pitta letter. Remember, nasalized H is called Pitta. Nasalized H is called Pitta. We have seen, remember? When the Aparishika Dhatu, you will see Dhatus, Edha Dhatu, Edha, the A is it, nasalized Hach, Hach. The content of the Dhatu will be Ed, Edha De, Edha De, Edha De. In the Dhatu Kosha, the first column, Aparishika Dhatu. Aparishika is the Dhatus which are taught, told by Pani Nagarishi. That is with the intellectuals. Remove the it, the content of Dhatu you will find, right, in the Dhatu portion. So, Nasika, Ananu Nasika. Ananu Nasika is opposite of Nasika. Negative, Dharma, Adharma. Kshara, Akshara. Similarly, Anu Nasika, Na Anu Nasika, Ananu Nasika. Opposite meaning. Okay, here the... Okay, first you understand this, right? Non nasalized and nasalized. Now, then the verbal could be Raswa, Raswaha, or Dirgaha, or it could be Rutaha. Ruta is that which has, which has three markers. Now, this Verbal A, which could be Swarita, Swarita, right? Swaradeta or Udata or Anudata. Udata, Anudata. Now let us take A. With this combination, Anunasika, Raswaha, the R which is Anunasika and Raswa can have can be Swarita. Right? Yes. So three are the Anunasika, Raswa and Swarita. Three. Similarly, the verbal R can be Anunasika. It can be Anunasika, Raswa and Udata. Again three. 3 plus 3, I am just adding here, okay, 3 plus 3, 
then the verbal a anunasika rasva it could be anudata plus 3 so 3 plus 3 plus 3 9 right similarly the verbal a anunasika it is dirga and swarita dirga swarita similarly anunasika dirga udaka anunasika dirga anudaka so how many are there the same way. three plus three six same here here also anunasika dirgaha swarita right anunasika dirgaha udaka anunasika dirgaha anudaka yes similarly on the vowel a could be anunasika krutaha swarita anunasika krutaha udaka anunasika krutaha anudaka so so you have again 3 plus 3 plus 3, 9. 9 are there. So here 3. So this is with Anunasika component with other forms. We got 9. Right? Same way. With, Anu, with Anunasika. A which is Anunasika, Raswa, Swarita. 1. A which is Anunasika, Raswa, Swarita, Udaka. Number 2. A which is Anunasika, Raswa, and Anudha. This is 3. So in the same way for Dirga, 3. For Pluta, 3. 3 plus 3 plus 3, 9. And here also 9. 9 plus 9. How many are the total? 18. This 18 are the seven half forms. So if you write like this, that is Ananu Nasika. Ananu Nasika. Rasva Svaritaha, this is number one, right? Similarly, Anunasika, Rasva, and it is Udaka. Anunasika, Rasva, Anudaka. Anunasika Dhirga. I'm copying the three. Three, I'm copying it. Space is not sufficient, so I minimize it. Anunasika, which is Dhirga. Dhirga Swarita, Anunasika, Dhirga Udata, Anunasika, Dhirga Anudata. So, six are the same thing for Ruta. Anunasika, Ruta Swarita, Anunasika, Ruta Udata, Anunasika, Ruta Anudata. So, how many are the nine? Same way you can make it for Anunasika. So 9 will be there. Right? So 9 plus 9, 18. This is for the, the, the vowels A, E, U, up to that. A, E, U. This is only for, I am writing the other 9 also. Just making it. Anunasika.
these are the 18 forms, right? Understand? 18 are there. Okay. So how do you write this? I'm just writing only for one. I is Ananasika, non-nasalized. Yes. Plus Va. Swarita, one stroke at the top. One stroke at the top, I can't put here. So I have to, you have to put one stop, one stroke at the top. Similarly, Rasva, Udhara. So I can write for Udhara, not for Swarita. Swarita, I have one stroke at the top. Okay. And Anudhara, underscore at the bottom. So this is Anuna Nasika. With Nasika, I am just writing one for here. Uh, which is which is uh, Nasika component, which is Rasva and it is Udhara. So these are the Sarana of the letter A. So in the Mahakeshwara Sutra, the A can bring all these 18 forms. Right? By mentioning just saying A, the short bubble, short bubble can bring its Sarana forms. 18 forms are there. What is the condition for Sarana form? When do you call two letters? When do you call a letter is seven or to another letter? Hmm? When? When, sir? Anchara. Say, Anchara Nakhana. Yes. And? Place of pronunciation. The place of pronunciation, also effort. But effort part we are not saying. Effort is a separate topic. Internal effort, external effort. The internal effort there are five types. External effort there are eleven types. It's out of scope. Okay, not required now. So. But it is interesting to know that also. So based on the Ucharana Sthana, that is our main focus. Okay, Ucharana Sthana. Strictly going by the rule, you have to take consider the internal effort also. But internal effort we are not discussing it now. Later will be studied, pardon me, that time I will introduce internal effort, external effort and all. But now, sthanam is fine. Kantaha, Tadu, Murdha, okay. So, two letters are in the same Uchchana sthanam, so it will be Savarna, mutually Savarna. So, A is a Kanta, whether it is Rasva, Dirga, Prutha, it is Kanta. Anudhata, Udhata, Svarita, it is Kanta. Whether it is nasalized or non-nasalized, Kanta. Therefore, Savarna. The R stands for 18 forms. They are all Sarana to each other. Right? So, I one R stands for 18 forms. If I want only A in a particular situation, in a particular situation, only A is required. How do we accomplish that? Remember? Hmm? Huh? Earth. Only A is required, we write Ath. If A is required, only A, A. If you don't write A in a, in a, in a sutra, in a rule comes, A, a only is mentioned. It can bring its all its Savarna forms. But our Savarna forms are not required. In that particular condition, only the short verbal alone required. Like the example, for example, Ath Anga. Apadanta A followed by the Guna letter Purva Parayavasthani Pararupa Adesha Remember? Another example Another example Adanta Anga followed by the Pratyaya beginning with the letter Yang letter Remember? Patami Patavaha Patamaha There only A at anga, short A only. If long A is there, then it won't apply. How it is accomplished? By saying at. Okay. This is how it is. Takara. Takaraha tatkalasya. Takaraha tatkala. Only that kala. It will bring only that kala. It will not bring virga and all. That is the idea. Okay. This is how it is accomplished. This are the sadhana. So, okay. So, we have talked about this. Uh, then, this word will be there. So, somewhere in the town. Anyway, so this is for the letter R. Similarly, for E, 
he will have 18 pounds. Who will have 18 pounds? What about the rib? The rib will have 18 pounds, right? Why not? Yes or no? Rib. A, E, O, Rib. Rib. Anunasika is there. And Anunasika also is there. Rasra is there. Dirga. There or no? Yes, there. Therefore, Pluta will be there. And Swarita, Udata, Anudata, all there. So, 18 pounds will be there for Rib. Right? So, Rib will have 18 pounds. This is 18, okay, some step, numerous. This is 18 forms. I don't want to change the font. Going back and forth, it takes uh, time. And we say R and L. R and L. Both are Savarna. R and L. Both are Savarna. Don't ask how. This is what it is. The Vayakana says R and L should be considered as Savarna. R alone has got 18 letters, Savarna. Right? And R and L are Savarna. And what about the Savarna letters for L alone? How many letters? How many Savarnas for L? How many? 12. Right? Why? Because it doesn't have Dirga not there. So, Dirga not there, therefore, the 6 possibilities minus. 18 minus 6. Right? Yes or no? So, here, Nasika, Anasika, that is 2. Rasva, Dirga, Rasva is the Pruta is the so 2 into 2, 4. 4 into Svaita, Udata, Anudata, 3, 12. Clear? So, Pruta will have 12 forms. 12 Savarna letters. Now, R and L, they are Savarna to each other. So, this 12, this 12 will be added to L also. So, therefore, R will have 30 Savarna forms. Similarly, since R and L are Savarna, you add the Savarna of R also to L. So, you get 30. So, R and L, they have 30 Savarna forms. This we discussed before. Yes or no? Yes, I think we discussed. and L. Not now. The last uh, course itself, I think we discussed. Okay. So, A, E, O, R, L is over. All the simple vowels are covered. Now, conjunct vowels. A is a, A and let us take A and I. How many Savarna forms for A? First of all, A is a short or long one? Any doubt in that? A is? What is its short form? Nasty. So, how many Savarna will be there now? The short is not there. So, 2 into 2 into 3. Right? Nasika, Anasika 2. And Rasva. Rasva not there. Dirga and Pruta. So, 2 into 2. Udata, Udata and Swarita, 3. So, 2 into 2 into 3, 4 into 3, 12 letters. Right? So, A has got 12. And what about I? Same. I also doesn't have short form. That's the not there. So, 12. In the same way for O also. O will be having 12. And O also 12. 12 marks. Right? You may ask why A and I are they not Savarna to each other? They are not Savarna. Why? If it is Savarna, then in the Mahesha Sutra, they need not be mentioned separately. A Ong, I Auj, because it is there the Mahesha Sutra, therefore we have to infer they are not Savarna. Even though the Stanam is same, they are not considered to be Savarna. Clear? This is about Savarna. Any doubt in this? A, I, O, 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 they are not Savarna. A and I are not Savarna to each other. Similarly, O is not Savarna to O. I mean, 
they are not sadhana. Okay. Even though the Uchana sthanam is same, how is not sadhana for O, I is not sadhana for A. The reason it is mentioned separately in the Mageshwara Sutra. Aom, I auch. If it is sadhana, that simply Ao is enough. I auch is not required. It is there. Okay. Huh? Yeah. Why don't we count it here? Where, where? Uh, in this Swara. Uh, it's also the one for high height. Oh, Dirga Swarita. Dirga Swarita it is not considered. It is only Swarita only. So it is Dirga. It's only a time. Already Dirga is covered in uh, the time, Kala Veda. That is not time. More higher than Swarita. That is Dirga only. Dirga. More high means rap. Rap yeah. means zero one up. <laughs> it's only stretched. Only in terms of time only. We are going up, but are not up, 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 not up, up above Swarita. Swarita is a, right, the same Swarita if it is elongated, Dirga Swarita. That is Swarita only, it is Dirga Swarita. It is called Dirga. Dirga is long, already long is covered. Kapur, not there. Okay. It is Dirga Swarita is not a, a high about a, a Swarita, not like that. Dirga Swarita means Mahavit Vishavahe Dirga only Dirga Swarita Clear? So these are the Sadhana What is the advantage of saying this Sadhana? See See I explained I don't have any notes for this So you have to understand and write your own notes If you want to copy this and uh, here something happened. Put the other that Dirga on somewhere. Anyway, you understand right? This whole thing. Then, what is the advantage of this uh, uh, this Savarna? This uh, what is the use of this? The knowledge of this Savarna form. What is Yansandi? Yen Sandhi is Hik followed by Hik followed by Asavarna Aj If it is just to say Aj If you say Aj The Aj includes E also Here also E is there E plus E will become Savarna Nita That is why when I thought you I told it is Asavarna Asadarna, Aj. In the uh, Sutra Bhata you will find only Aj. There you will not give Asadarna and Dal. You have to understand that it is an exception. Okay, that, that we will see. Sutra Gala, I will not say Asadarna, Savarna and Dal. Other Sutra will take care of the Savarna. From that we have to understand, oh it is an exception. If same letters come, then we cannot apply this one. That apply Savarna Gala Sandhi. That is how Sutra Gala presents. Now, in this sutra you take it followed by Asavarna Aj. Which is a Stani? Stani. Huh? It is a Stani. You go to that. Adesha. Adesha is? What are the Adesha? Yen. Yen is the Adesha. Say Yen. So it will be replaced by Yen. So, it followed by Asadarna. What are the N letters? Yakara. A is only for Uchara Yakara, Pakara, Epa, and Lakara. So, Yavarala. So, N is Yavarala. And Yakara also has its Savarna, nasalized Yakara. Already we have seen. Yakara has got nasalized. Yakara. Vakara, nasalized. Repa, doesn't have. Vakara, nasalized. They don't have Anadatha Swarita, Udhartha, Anadatha. That's only for the verbals. Virga, Raswamrata, it's only for the verbals. Only Nasika, Anasika. Okay. Yakara, nasalized Yakara. Vakara, which is Anadatha Nasika, whose Sarma is 
అనునాసిగా లకార రేపా డజంట లకార అనునాసిక లకార ఊస్ కాంపనెంట్ సగన్న కాంపనెంట్ ఇస్ అనునాసిక లకార సంధి వ్యాల్ సీన్ రైట్ ఓకే సో దాట్ ఫోర్ ఇయర్ జస్ట్ ఎకార రైట్ బికాస్ గ్యాస్ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్ ఇట్స్ నేచరలైజ్డ్ కాంపనెంట్ సిమిలర్లీ లకార అకార స్టాండ్స్ ఫర్ ఇట్స్ నేచరలైజ్డ్ కాంపనెంట్ రేపా డజంట్ హ్యావ్ సో ఐ కెన్ పుట్ కమా ఇయర్ రేపా డజంట్ హ్యావ్ రేపా ఓన్లీ రేపా సో లకార విల్ హ్యావ్ లకార అండ్ ఇట్స్ నేచరలైజ్డ్ కాంపనెంట్ ఇస్ లా ఓకే దీస్ ఆర్ ది ఎన్ లెటర్ ఓకే అండ్ ఎన్ ఇస్ ది ఆదేశ వాట్ అబౌట్ ఈక్ ఈక్ ఇస్ ఈ అండ్ ఈ స్టాండ్స్ ఫర్ ఈ ఈ ఆల్ ఎయిటీన్ ఫార్మ్స్ ఆర్ దర్ సో ఐ కెనాట్ రైట్ ఆల్ ఎయిటీన్ ఫార్మ్స్ అండ్ జస్ట్ రైట్ ఎయిటీన్ ఓకే ఊ స్టాండ్స్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ది ఎయిటీన్ ర స్టాండ్స్ ఫర్ ఎయిటీన్ నో థర్టీ రైట్ అండ్ లు స్టాండ్స్ ఫర్ థర్టీ followed by asavarana aj followed by asavarana aj so it means you have to in- include the letters asavarana aj is what are the asavarana aj a is not the i is the uh, no, why not a is the a is the see in fact you have to bring all the vowels all the vowels and its eighteen forms if same letters are there then yen chandi will not apply in purva and uttara the same letters are not there then this rule will not apply you have to apply savana dirga so ach will bring all the letters a e o r l then a i o o a stands for 18 forms right e stands for its 18 forms o stands for its 18 forms and uh, the r stands for 30 forms and u for 30 forms and a stands for its 12 forms and similarly i o o so by just saying ik you are bringing so many letters how many letters you are bringing 18 plus 18 plus 30 plus 30 how many letters 60 60 plus uh, 36 96 letters right all right 96 and here how many letters we include all the letters h can count how many are there so 12 plus 48 and uh, 108 108 plus 54 108 plus 54 how much 108 plus 54 it is 162 is right in number some number comes to it so when we say ik is followed by aj asavarna aj replace ik by yan the ik stands for so many letters that stands for so many letters it means any possibility can come when you do sandhi all the possibilities are covered, covered by just saying ik followed by asavarna aj you don't have to write written e followed by a e followed by u e followed by r how many sutras you will write for every combination you have to write one mark made it very simply e followed by asavarnaj replaced by yan clear this is how alpaksharam sutram so this goes all the possibility so if i take one letter from e e one letter from a one possibility again and taking e followed by e will not come if e comes it goes dirga sandhi so take o another possibility e plus you can keep on adding all the vowels e plus all the vowels except e that is covered right so now e plus r plus l plus now e plus a which is yadesha here taking this one example e plus a which is yadesha ha huh? 
uh, which is istani, which is istani, which is yadesha. Okay. Istani is ki. Istani should be replaced by now the adesha. What is adesha? Which one you will ask now? Which yakara? Yakara two sir, two yakara sir there. Nasalized yakara, non nasalized yakara. Which one? Huh? Always non nasalized. Only one letter can be placed. Only one seat is there. How many persons can sit here? Only one person. So therefore, if it is an Adesha, it will not bring its Savarna. Even though Yakara is Savarna, it will not bring its Savarna. Because only one seat, two persons cannot sit. Therefore, Adesha will not bring its Savarna. If it is Tani or if it is a Nimitta, it will bring its Savarna. This is how Every rule is presented, every rule you have to understand like this. Therefore, E plus A is, E will be replaced with Yakara. We will have only one form. It can't, it can't have a nasalized. No. Because only one stani is replaced by Yakara. Therefore, you get here. Right? If Adesha, Adesha, right? Adesha cannot bring it to the that's what I said. Stani will win. That is why, if it, that's why you cover all the rules. How do you say it, 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 it is the uh, Yen Sandi? Right? Nasalized and the Sandi will not happen. Don't worry about it. The, it will happen. All the work, right? it stands, that's all. But we don't see all those, those things. Don't worry. If at all we bring the Savarna, E only, the long E. E, E. That is how you will find the application. That nasal is not in there. How does? This we don't have to know. Right? What happens also is not, we don't know. And uh, Pluta also, Sandhi will not happen. Those things are uh, not required. But you understand how it is, Sutra is, is, you know, condenses the whole set of possibilities. Right? This is what is Savarna is. Now you understand Savarna? Here? Yeah? So, Adesha will not bring Savarna. Stani in the Nimitta will bring Savarna. That covers all the possibilities. Right? Okay. In fact, I don't want to tell this detail, but I, I cover this also. So, it will be useful later. Any doubt in this? You understand? Okay. Now, I said I will introduce one Sandhi, that also I will do it here. You have the chart with you, Visarka Sandhi. Now next topic, Visarka Sandhi. Is a chart is there? Okay. The answer now. Padanta Sakara will become? Repa. Repa followed by? Repa followed by? Other than curl letter, hush or ach. What will happen? Huh? Repa followed by Ach or Hash. I'm just asking in general, okay? Not Repa. Then you have to ask me, what is the preceding letter? When it is other than Khar, heart consonant, I said Ach or Hash. If that is so, then you have to ask, what is the preceding letter? If, right? Visarga is followed by Hash or Hash, then you have to look for the preceding letter. Visarga preceded by A, followed by A. Visarga preceded by A, followed by Hash. Visarga preceded by A and followed by Hash or Hash. All those possibilities. Remember the first sheet, the 23, 22 rules are given. All those rules are covered. Now in this new chart, everything is covered. Okay. Now, Visarga preceded. Um, it's like followed by, followed by khar, what will happen? Remember this, Visarga followed by ach or hash or, or ash. Then you have to look for the preceding letter. If it is followed by khar, don't bother about what, don't bother about the which is preceding letter. What follows is important, if it is a khar letter, okay. Kar letter we have seen. Kar, kha. What will happen to Visarga? 
other reserve ga that's called jitva amuliya if it is pa artha other reserve ga it is called upadmaniya if, if the four letters are over other letters out of 13 letters four are gone other letters are there it will be replaced by sakara and sakara further undergoes changes depending on the following letters chutvam ashtutvam clear now listen visarga preceded by khar sorry visarga followed by khar visarga followed by khar visarga is uh, replaced by is replaced by sakara replaced by sakara if it is ka artha then it is replaced by other visarga pa artha replaced by other visarga otherwise sakara now visarga followed by i give one example rishayaha right rishayaha kelanti rishayaha kelanti rishayaha kelanti what will happen visarga preceded by not required followed by what kar letter so what will happen jikwa moliya so either ardha visarga or visarga visarga will remain as it is or it will be replaced by ardha visarga that is a rule right so rashaya rashaya khelanti you can say right rashaya khelanti rashaya khelanti now rashaya Shina Kal Mashaha. This is from Gita. Okay. Shina Kal Mashaha. Now, Visarga followed by followed by huh? continuous constant. Okay, but this is Visarga. Okay. What is the what are the what are the letters in the continuous constant? Kaka and followed by. Murdani Shaka. So is it not a third letter? Yes. So what will happen to Visarga if you apply the general rule? Visarga will be replaced by Ardha Visarga, optionally. So it is either Visarga or Ardha Visarga. What is the rule in the chart? The chart. Rule number. Rule number is there? 11. 11, okay. So, yeah, rule number, it is 11B and 11C. Visarga will take the sound of Upadmaniya, then followed by Pa Artha. Visarga will take the sound of Chikvamoliya, then followed by Ka Artha, right? And this is optional, okay? Because Cha is a, it is optional. But Visarga will take the Sound up. Sound means it is Ardha Visarga. Okay, I will modify that. Visarga will be replaced by Ardha Visarga and followed by Pa Arpa. And that Ardha Visarga is called Upad, Upadmanita. Now, here, Visarga is followed by Khar letter. Okay. And the Khar letter is followed by followed by Shar letter. Car letter is followed by Shar letter. If that is so, then Car letter followed by Shar letter. Okay, what follows Car also you have to watch. <laughs> if that is so, then Visarga will be replaced by Visarga. Visarga will be replaced by Visarga. There is no Jikva Moliya, Ardha Visarga. Visarga must be replaced only by Visarga. Visarga must be replaced only by Visarga. It's a must. Therefore, when you chant, when you read this, Rishaya Kshina Kalma Shaha, you cannot, you cannot read. It's a long read. Rishaya Kshina Kalma Shaha, it must be read like that. Why? Because Visarga is followed by Kar letter. Kar is followed by Shar. 
Okay. Understand? Another example. Who comes in Vishnu Sarasthanam? Uddhava Shobhano Shobha. No. Uddhava Uddhava Shobhano Devaha Shigarbha Parameshwaraha So here Uddhava is the Visarga followed by Kshara Tangent Consonant Kakara plus Shakara Kakara is Kar Shakara is Shar So Shar follows Kar Shar follows Kar Understand? Shar follows Kar So in Sanskrit we can say Shar follows Kar is Shar Pare Kar Shar Letter Follows Kar Shar Pare Kari We always use of the name Okay Or Shar Shar Pare Kar Shar Letter Follows Kar If it is difficult to understand Then you can simply write like this Kar Letter Followed by Shar Then Visarga will be replaced by Visarga That's the rule I will show you the rule You can write Okay First you understand this This the rule I am showing you now You can write This rule In the chart the chart, I am inserting this rule in between the rule number you can see 10 rule number 10 so this chart, after some time you have to discard okay you have to discard this chart after some time, you have to introduce some more rules now you can see when the Nisarga is followed by Kar which in turn followed by Shar then Nisarga is replaced by Nisarga Example, Sukhinaha Kshatriya, this is also from Gita only. Sukhinaha Kshatriya. So, Visarga will remain Visarga. It will not be replaced by Ardha Visarga. Jukva Muliya, no. Okay. That's all the rule. Sharparekhar. If you want to name it, Sharparekhar Vidhi, then name it. Then just write like naming it. Shar Pare Kar Nidhi Shar Pare Kar Nidhi Example Sukhinaga Kshatriya or Rishayaha Kshinakal Vashaha So mainly you will find this Sandhi, I mean this Vidhi Followed by Ksha, followed by the conjunct consonant Ksha, because which is combination of Akara plus Shakara. Right? This is what then you will find Ksha. If any other letter, uh, uh, Kar letter comes, followed by Shar, apply this rule. Visarga must be pronounced. Visarga must be pronounced. We cannot say Sukhina Kshatriya, wrong. Sukhina Kshatriya. Visarga is replaced by Visarga. What happens? The same thing remains. No. Visarga must be replaced by Visarga. Visarga is the Stani. Stani is replaced by Adesha, which is also Visarga. Clear? Yes. So, this is rule number 10, inserted after 9 in the chart. You can write this Vidhi and one example. One more example you want, you can write the Rishayara Shrinakul Mashaha. I'm writing that example also here. This is a table. Okay, try it. Shrinakul Mashaha. So this will remain as Rishayara Shrinakul Mashaha.
Các em sẽ đọc với Rule number 10 Shut for a girl Remember Followed by girl The circle under those changes And if the curl is followed by Shut The circle will remain The circle will remain next Replaced by the circle Any doubt on this? No. Written? No. Now the next one. This is what with the Sharpare. Again, what is that? Sharpare kar. Now we will see karparesha. We will see karparesha. Now, see, example. Rukshaha plus Stavraha. What's in the? Rukshaha plus Stavraha. This harga preceded by, not required. Why? Because followed by Sakar, which is a Third letter. Yes. So you don't have to look for the preceding letter. The sarga followed by third letter. Within a third, what is that? So therefore we can apply what with the on the chart. What with the you can apply? The sarga followed by applying the rule whatever you know. What is the result? Tell me. Ah, the sarga followed by yeah. Change the sakara. Good. So therefore, Rikshastavaraha. Can I write? Or, what will happen? Visarga followed by Kar. Visarga is replaced by Sakara. That's okay. Or, and the Sakara happens to be a Shara also. Happens to be Shara also. If it is Shara, what did we say? Replacement of Visarga by Sakara is optional. So, you will have Rukshaha Stavaraha. Yes? Now we see one more option is there. That's what this rule is. One more. That is, now you see. Visarga is there. Visarga. Followed by what letter? Followed by Kar. Within a Kar, what is that? Shar. It's a shell letter. Followed by curl letter. Shell plus curl. Visarga followed by shell. Shell followed by curl. Yes or no? This is karpare shari. Karpare shari. Curl follows shell. Yes or no? Right? So, Shara is Sakara, Takara is is Kar. If this is a case, if this is a case, then what will happen? Then Visarga becomes Lopaha optionally. Visarga will become Lopaha optionally. So therefore, what is the form you will get here? One more form. Ruksha Stavaraha. Another form. This is by this the rule. Visarga followed by Shar. Shar followed by Kar. Then Visarga will become Lopaha. Optionally. I will show the rule. First you understand the Vidhi. I will show the rule in the table. Then you can write. This is Kalpare 
Shar. The previous one was Shar Parekar. This is Kar Paresha. So one day is there for you to do homework. Think, get, get, get settled in your mind. Understand? So now, don't write. I'm showing the exam, the table. This is also inserted in the table. This rule is a Vartika. This rule is a Vartika. Vartika means what? What is Vartika? Huh? That which was not told by Pranaya Magadishi, Vartika Kara will tell, he will add. This should have been told, he did not tell, so I am telling you. So Vartika Kara will add. Who is Vartika Kara? Varaduchi. Vartika Kara, Vartika Kara is Vartika Kara, Varaduchi. Otherwise called Kartyayani. So, according to Vartika Kara, Visarka will become Lopaha, then followed by Kar, which in turn followed by, sorry, will follow by Shar, which in turn followed by Kar. That is Kar Pareshan. So, this I have inserted this rule, you can see. Optional, yes. So, when Visarga is followed by Shar, which in turn followed by Kar, then Visarga is dropped optionally. So, Visarga can be replaced by Sakara also, that is by the general rule, Visarga followed by Kar. Or Visarga will remain as it is, if it is followed by Shar. Or Visarga will be dropped, when Shar is followed by Kar. So, three forms are there. So, this is Rukhya Hakuksha Stavaraha. So, you can write the Vidhi as Kar Pare Shar Vidhi. This is Number 11, the chart you have to add this. Karpare Shalvi. But this rule you will not find it uh, generally in the, in the books. The, what I generally you will see, the Sarga will be there. That Shalvi. That is Shar is Visarga replay by Sakara option. That is what you generally will find. Visarga will be there generally. But we have to understand. Visarga is not that this and this happened. We have to know. That is why this video is. So today we have seen Savarna and Shar Parekar, Kar Pareshya. The next lesson we will do tomorrow. 16th lesson. Vartika. I said Vartika. Vartika is under this bar, uh, number, rule, rule 8336. Yes, given the Vartika. Vartika doesn't have number. Whatever the sutra is there, for the sutra only, the Vartika will be there. So that will be within bracket I have written Va. Va means not optional. Va is Vartika. Dot.
any 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 any